Hello and welcome back to Zero Dot the Epic Horizon Zero Dawn. Okay, we go for the hunt of the Fire Claws. Take a deep breath. Yes, this will be a tough ride. We're meant to trust the card. We'll trust the card. Uh, all right let me check okay i have the right weapon and uh, on my way i will collect some healing please will keep oh my god so i'm so poor <laughs> okay <laughs> Uh, yay. But yeah, I want to do as much as possible, <laughs> as I said. So yeah. <laughs> okay. Great. Words down. It'll be down, yeah. Okay. I'm a little bit pissed. <laughs> I fought this epic fight against this fire claw and I won. And I'm really proud of myself. And what happened? The video was saved on the wrong hard drive there was like I don't have a lot of space there on this hard drive yeah so OBS stopped recording so you sadly didn't see this epic fight I had full well, already I'm really upset Okay. Um, yeah. So we killed the fa first fire claw, and it was really bad. And, um, So let me take it. Um, okay. It's okay. <laughs> I collect everything that we get now. Because... Oh, I have to fight 
Yeah, I have to fight two more, right? Okay, let's travel. Mm. I need water. <laughs> I don't want to record already because I know what ha what is happening. What is going to happen? Yeah, great. Build a, a campfire exactly where... This. That's amazing. Right. a waste of time and it's really like me impossible to do no 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 I don't want to do it uh -uh. I go for the last quest I'm sorry I don't want I so don't want to do it it's so not worth it really really not worth it. I'm nearly dead and no. The tramplers. Mm -mm. Or whatever the name of these is, I don't know. Those bulls and bears and yeah, go. Leave me alone. I don't want to do it. <clears throat> Thank you. 
I want to play this game because it's fun and not because I get my ass kicked <laughs> and get stressed. Nope. Thanks. Uh, Alright, so now I'm here. Is there anyone I can ask for maybe... No. Okay. Have a better one. Okay. Uh, so. It's hard not to feel a little jealous. Who's home? Stay sharp. Go on I'm heading down. down. I've spent a lifetime trying to uncover the secrets of this world. Where the machines came from. How the old ones achieved such marvels only to fall into silence and death. A lifetime of failure. As year by year, decade after decade, I hit walls I could not break, doors I could never breach. Hello. Until a Nora Huntress marched out of the savage east. And, voila, for her, all the deepest secrets of the earth were laid bare. I suspect you will have an easier time with this door than I did years ago. Hold for identiscan. Genetic profile confirmed. Entry authorized. Malfunction. 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 Are you kidding me? You don't hear me laughing. Shut up. There's gotta be another way. Hey! Elizabeth Snowback here! Requesting access! Access request acknowledged. Root command functions available. Do you wish to proceed? I do! Get me through this door! Analyzing. Primary access inoperable due to mechanical failure. Emergency venting procedure likely to circumvent blockage. Do you wish to proceed? Yes. Emergency venting authorized. Everything. That will draw attention. We won't have this place to ourselves for long now. We? Last I checked, I was the one whisking my life down here. Yes, fine. Now, will you please get moving? There's so much to learn in less time than I'd hoped. Okay. Welcome to Project Zero Dawn. Zero Dawn. We found it. Are you really so surprised? Facility diagnostics detect multiple failures. Attempting repair. So, what was this room? An entrance hall, perhaps. Have a look around. Okay. <clears throat> A slip of parchment. 
Arthur's Crocs and Poplets. You miserable wonks have failed to find me. Durval. We're but a gut kill yourselves to save me the effort. Mail? I don't know. <coughs> the Mad Sun King, blah blah blah, pros and wells, all your data points. whatever if I cannot listen to it I don't care please take a seat and wait for your name to be called a selection of beverages and snacks are available Selection of herbal teas. Steep demand jokes, okay. Okay, whatever. I'd have to leave something else behind. Nothing here. possible to improve the soundproofing between VR1 and the LASH area? Most of the candidates stay quiet during the presentation, but the ones who scream or sob can be plainly heard by candidates waiting their turn in the LASH. Just a thought. Proceed into viewing room one for an important message regarding the purpose of your visit. What? What was this place? A holographic theater. CD01 data intact. Initiating playback. Welcome to Project Zero Dawn. I am General Harris, Chairman of the Joint Chiefs of Staff of the United States of America. I'm sure you've heard the rumors that Zero Dawn is a top-secret super-weapons program, the technological miracle that will save us from the Pharaoh Plague, if Operation Enduring Victory can hold off the robots long enough. The reason I'm sure you've heard the rumors is that I'm the one who spread them, and they are all lies. Zero Dawn is not a super-weapons program. And it will not save us. Nothing will save us. Here's why. By the time the glitch was noticed, it was already too late. Nothing could stop the Pharaoh Plague. Nothing can. Its robots will continue to replicate and devour the biosphere. Life on Earth will be destroyed. Our planet reduced to a barren sphere. Global extinction is inevitable. No matter how many we kill, the robots just keep exponentially making more. If we had their deactivation codes, we could shut them all down. The entire swarm. But since their cryptographic protocols use polyphasic entangled waveforms, cracking a code set would take half a century. At best, we've got 16 months. Not exactly what you'd call a survival option. 
The destruction of a biosphere is not the sort of apocalypse you can wait out in a fallout shelter or a space station. There will be no Earth left to reclaim. Just a lifeless, toxic rock with several million pharaoh robots on it, hibernating, waiting for something to eat. This is the horrible truth behind the lies of Operation Enduring Victory. My lies. Lies designed to inspire millions of innocents to sacrifice themselves in battle. Why? One reason. To buy time for you and the work you will do here. Zero Day. The day that life on Earth ceases to exist is coming fast. It cannot be stopped. The hope of Zero Dawn is that something new might come after. But I will leave it to Elizabeth Sobek to shine that thin ray of light into the darkness. Harris, out. That doesn't make sense. Life on Earth didn't cease to exist. He said it could not be stopped. But it was. Somehow... Somehow Elizabeth saved us. I've, I've got to keep looking. Find out how she did it. Kestrels. They got in. Through the vents. Let nothing stop you from learning the truth. Spread out! If it moves, kill it! What is this place? Tomb? Okay. Let's take her down. I'm done. Am I done? Is off. I will have to pay for that. Is accurate, yes. So these mechanical monstrosities, they don't just kill people. They feed off them? Not just people. All organic matter. Every living thing dissolves into nutrients. Millennia of evolution liquefied. The miracle of life reduced to bloody biofuel. In a word, yes. Who did this? Pharaoh? That asshole. Is he here? No, Doctor. Please, tell him Tom Pike wants a word. Now, get off! Get off! Uh, Doc, uh, please! You get Ted Pharaoh in here! Understandable. I would be pissed too. 
Want to discuss? Oof. So Mama, she was right. Pardon? My mother, she took her Bible real serious. Not just Texas Bubble serious, Pentecostal serious. Favorite chapter? Revelations. Now, I didn't always understand her on account of all that speaking in tongues and such, but when she did use her words, there was always end times this and the lake of fire that on account of sinful lifestyles. Speaking of which, mind if I smoke? A tobacco cigarette. Sorry, darling. My taste run classic. Compliments your team tracked me down. Been a price on my head 18 months now. Sterling Malky was me, don't mind admitting. Been plenty of snakesters chasing the bounty, too. But I kept the zigging to their zag. How'd you finger me? I believe Dr. Sobek listed you as an alpha candidate. Priority snatch and grab. Always suspected she had a little thing for me. Hey, I don't suppose you got real coffee in this place. You know, blood coffee? Conflict cappuccinos? Mr. Tate, I'm clearing you to proceed. Just go. Tate? Mm -hmm. Who previously worked for Faro Automated Systems. On the chariot line self-replication routines? I came here thinking this was a, a rendition. When your people took me, I, I thought, about time. I've been trying to swallow the guilt every day since... Since, uh... Would you like to take a moment? No, 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 I, I just... I really hoped Zero Dawn was a way to undo it all. My work. Yeah. I'm sorry to say I was ever proud of it, but... Tech could really sell a concept, and, and, and in the labs, in the, the, the light of creation, that first test run, when, when you saw they understood their own structures, could rebuild themselves from memory and light, there were no limits. God, there were no limits. Hmm. Yeah, sometimes people take things too far. Okay. Okay, so that would that would be this. Okay. Oh no. I didn't want to have this. I wanted this. Okay. No! What are you doing? I'm sure you now understand the urgency of why we brought you here, Ms. Okilo. Captain Okilo, are you trying to thank me for not resisting? I believe we could negotiate a diplomatic solution. When it came to my country's lithium, it was always a swarm that would be sent to negotiate. Metallurgic International, U.S. Robot Command. The markings changed, but the robots were the same. You have had considerable experience in human-robot conflict. Yes, and I've got the prosthetic limbs to show it. Yet I continue to face this horror, even though the challenge was great. Cyber warfare. I thought Zero Dawn would be a, a Manhattan project to generate the deactivation codes. With the resources I had, I estimated code breaking to be a hopeless endeavor. I was almost looking forward to being proved wrong. Unfortunately, your estimation was correct. As your General Hera said. So then, you did not bring me here to commiserate. What is left? Hmm. So, Counselor Guidelines. Candidates must be allowed to ask questions and be given the necessary time to fully absorb the information they have received. It is essential to stress that all other options for combating the feral plague and preserving the continuation of human life have been considered and found unworkable. Okay. Alright. 
speaking with Suzanne Alford, environmental scientist. Doctor? I'm sorry, I wasn't, uh... Just stating your name. What were you thinking about, Doctor? Nothing the General said, not really. I was on the Syzygy East response team in 2051, just after the second earthquake compromised the reactor. I still dream about it, after all these years. The red zone spreading on the imaging slowly, so slowly, like a hand opening its fingers. Your involvement in that event is why you were asked for by name. Really? That's interesting. Because nothing worked. Nothing could grow there again. It was a catastrophic failure. But the red zone is a blip compared to global-scale biomass reduction. The biosphere and hydrosphere will collapse, render the Earth uninhabitable long before the robots finish us. Enduring victory can't buy time against that. So, you'd better show me what Zero Dawn really is. Hmm, <laughs> and they did. Didn't they? Okay. What is this? There is some mistake. I don't understand why I was brought here. Why would you show me these things? I know that there's already a lot to take in. In the waiting area, I was seated with a noble laureate in biophysics and a monk, I think. He spoke neither English nor Mandarin. It is very strange. And General Harris? What was he talking about? The robot swarm, the feral plague? I understand it is terrible, but it really cannot be stopped. Why tell us this? There are people in Shanghai, my friends, my family. They have joined Operation Enduring Victory already. It is for nothing? We will all die? We're going to be able to answer some of these questions. I just want to know why I am here. It doesn't make sense to me. You were brought here because of your skill set. No, that can't be right. I am an art historian. I know Dutch masters, Japanese calligraphy, uh, Gerhard Richter. What does that matter now? <laughs> 